I'm Sarah Hightower, I'm from Stafford, Virginia, and during my junior year of high school, I took a trip up to Penn State and absolutely loved it. I fell in love with the campus and decided that this was the only place I wanted to go. And once I got here, I knew that I wanted to pursue a biology degree, but after taking a couple micro courses, I decided that biotechnology with a clinical laboratory science option because you can work just about anywhere, including a cruise ship or a zoology laboratory. And I'd actually like to work with big cats and hopefully do research and conservation. So I have been pursuing that ever since and I'm currently in the practicum year, which is in the hospital. A typical day, once you get to your practicum year, is waking up at 5 to 5.30 and making sure that you're at the hospital by 6.30 in the morning. Depending on which department you're in, you may go for your first stint is a nine weeks in micro, or what I did was um, five weeks in chemistry, and then I'm in hematology now for another five weeks. And that's been my favorite part of this whole experience is learning to draw blood and getting to interact with those patients on a daily basis. Some advice that I have for incoming freshmen is to pay attention to your, in your 200 and 100 level courses because that's going to be the foundation that they build the rest of your academic career on. Another good idea is to talk to different professors, get to the, know them, and let them get to know you. And this opens up a lot of doors, recommendation letters for jobs or for graduate programs. And you can also do research with them as a possibility. And through Penn State and my education here, I've been able to secure REU uh, fellowships and have done research at other universities and have a lot of experience through that and have also um, participated in a co-op at GlaxoSmithKline, which is a really large pharmaceutical company. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact the BMB office here at Penn State.